Hello everyone, welcome to VLSI Toolbox channel. Today I will be talking about CMOS inverter design and simulation using LT Spice. So without wasting time, let's see how it works. So this is the window of LT Spice app. Once you install the LT Spice and if you invoke the LT Spice app, the screen will come like this. So for new schematic, you can click on here also or from file, new schematic. So this is new schematic editor. Next for making circuit, we need component and for component, you can click here. So you have to choose your component. So for a uh, CMOS inverter, we need PMOS and NMOS. So let's search for PMOS 4, 4 means 4 terminal and place it here, escape. Again, NMOS 4, place it here, escape escape is used to cancel the previous command now with the help of where we can connect this now we need ground one ground for input and one ground for biasing escape and again connect you can use mouse uh, sc scrolling wheel to zoom in or zoom out the circuit next we need voltage sources so search it for voltage escape then you connect it with the help of wire now you can use the drag command icon to drag the instances wherever you want escape also you can uh, name the port what whichever is your output whichever is your input you can name it using this one this icon v out for output escape you can use drag to drag uh, the voltage source some distant place of uh, make a space for V out okay then use where to connect This is the complete diagram of uh, CMOS inverter and it is now ready to do analysis. For doing analysis, you have to give the values to voltage sources. So right click on the voltage sources, give 5 volt, okay, again here 5 volt, okay. Now. This uh, test bench is ready for doing uh, DC analysis. Okay, one more terminal is left. This is body terminal. 
so you have to connect the body terminal to the source again and MOS body terminal to the MOS source now it is complete now let's do DC analysis first for that press run a window will uh, um, pop up you can uh, give your simulation uh, command so for DC analysis click on DC sweep so first source which source you want to sweep this is the V1 so V1 type of switch linear start value 0 to 5 so the command is ready for uh, spice simulator okay now you can probe the signal input it is varying from 0 to 5 volt output it is giving the transfer card VTC card so this is all about for DC analysis now let's do transient analysis now close it and I have to delete the command by right clicking on the command delete the command for DC analysis now we have to configure this input voltage source as pulse and connect one capacitor at the output load at the output so connect one capacitor first give ground signal to this capacitor now right click on this give one peak of head one p pick of red and right click on this source click on advanced next give pulse initial value is 0 volt and final value is 5 0 to 5 for the sake of simplicity I am not giving any delay price time fall time now T on if you give 10 millisecond as T on then period will be twice of T on so to get 50% duty cycle and cycle 0 ok now uh, using the drag you can drag this here to get better visualization and now let us do transient analysis for this we have to press again run button this window will pop up select transient you have to give stop time more than the time period 20 millisecond is our period suppose I am uh, giving 5 repetitions so 100 millisecond starting from 0 ok then press ok now window is pop up you can probe the signal this is the input and this is the output so you can see input output is showing if you want to split the window then right click on this add plot plane and you can segregate this view out to the screen so to get pattern resolution so this is the um, a transient analysis and uh, if you want to save the plot you can go to file save the plot as PLT format it will save the PLT format and the plot will be saved in PLT format and uh, if you want to take the screenshot you can use the print screen button or uh, sniping tool to snap this window for your lab copy and this is the circuit diagram you have to take a screenshot and uh, paste it in your lab copy or according to the instruction given by the instructor. So that's all for uh, transient analysis. Hope you have got some valuable information from this video. So please share and subscribe my channel 
so to get more such videos in future thank you